Hello there and uh, welcome to a completely different type of video on my channel. I've never really expected to do anything like this because my channel has always been all about just talking about music, reviewing music and uh, sharing my opinions on music. But today I kind of felt like I'm a bit bored and I'm still kind of in a Eurovision hype mood. Um, so there's a website. I don't know how many of you know about it, but it's called Sporko. And it's basically a website where people post quizzes to make, uh, or that anyone can play. Uh, where they ask about, you know, it could be any topic, it could be geography, it could be sports, it could be movies, music, it could be Eurovision. And I've noticed there's a lot of quizzes about Eurovision on this site. And I'm all, I've always been kind of a quiz person, I guess. I'm a bit of a nerd in that sense. I like learning a lot of stuff and statistics and things about certain like very specific things and i guess eurovision has kind of become one of those i think i'm somewhat good at knowing a few things about eurovision i don't know but um i've always wanted to kind of try out my the things i know about eurovision and i found this quiz on sporko it's by a person called m lingua uh, and i found out that this person has made a bunch of quizzes down here that I could play if this is a thing that you would like to see return on this channel. I'm only trying it out for fun now, but if if you like this kind of more chill, just have fun type of video where you can watch me and laugh at me for, for how little or how much I know, I don't know, uh, then do tell me in the comments because this is going to be a really easy video for me to make and I just kind of, I, as I said, I'm kind of bored and I want something fun to do and I think this fits the bill right as well. And I thought, hey, I'm going to play it. Why not just record and see how, how uh, bad or how good I am at it? Anyway, I'm talking too much, uh, as always. Um, this is a quiz, then, which uh, is about the Eurovision Song Contest best results. And it's sorted for each country. So for, you can see here on the screen, all of the countries that have participated in Eurovision are on the screen. And their best result is here to the right. And I have to figure out the song title for all of these songs. And I know for a fact that I'm not going to get all of them. I already can tell you that. But uh, I'm going to try and get as many as possible. And if you want to, uh, I would recommend that you uh, also do the quiz before you watch me do it. So we can compare our results and you can see how well you did and compare it to how well I did. Uh, I'll be leaving the link to it in the description below, so you can click it. You can pause the video, you click it, you play the quiz, and then you can come back if you want to. Or you can just skip to the end and see how many I got right. Um, but yeah, do that if you want to. Uh, I think we're just going to get going here. Uh, we have 10 minutes, and there are 52 countries that have participated, which have a best result. I don't know if this is updated from 2022. Um... Because you see, Ukraine has a best result of first. I don't know, did they get 631 points this year, or was that with Jamala? I don't know. Uh, but I guess, I guess we'll figure these things out. Um, let's just start playing it. So, Albania. I know this is the song Sus. Uh, Andorra, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna leave that one for now. Armenia is not alone. What? Oh my. When have Armenia finished fourth? Is it Kele Kele? Wow! Oh, I was certainly was not alone. Okay. Australia, Sound of Silence. Austria, Rise Like a Phoenix. I'm on a roll, I think. Azerbaijan, Running Scared. Uh, Belarus, Work Your Magic. I'll, I'll be really interesting to see how, how many of these you know as well. Um, Belgium has to be Jamel La Vie. Should have been Sanomi, but... That's for another that's for another time. Leila for Bosnia. Bulgaria. Um oh god, what's the song called? I love it to bits. <laughs> but I forgot the name of it. This is the thing about Sporkle. You're gonna get so frustrated just sitting here and thinking, what was the song called? Um Beautiful Mess. That's what it was called. Croatia, fourth, 118 points. I think that's Maria Magdalena. Uh, it's called Maria Magdalena, isn't it? Oh, it's with a J. Okay. Fuego. Czech Republic, sixth place. That's lie to me, right? Denmark, uh, only teardrops, I think. 
Yeah, Estonia, everybody. We're on a roll. Hard Rock Hallelujah. All right, France. First place, 136 points. So here's the thing. France hasn't won since 1977, I believe. And I don't know which of their, what is it, like four or five winners they have that got 136 points. It could be the... L wow. Louis Lomphon. No, I don't... God. <laughs> I just embarrassed myself in front of all of you, I guess. Uh, I don't know the song title. I'm going to leave that one for now. Georgia, that has to be one more day. Ninth place. Oh, it's Shine then. Okay. Germany, Satellite, Greece, my number one. We've got seven and a half minutes left. It's all good. We're, we're good with time. Uh, Hungary, fourth place. Running finished fifth, didn't it? Fourth place. Oh, no, it's the one from from 94 with this super long title. I'm never going to get that one. Nope, sorry. It has like a ridiculously long title and it's all in Hungarian. I will never get that. Good song, though, <laughs> but I will never get it. Iceland, second place, 218 points. Has to be, is it true? Out of Luck also came second, but yeah, they didn't get that many points back then. Ireland, 226 points. Could it be The Voice? Could it be Rock and Roll Kids? It was. That's actually their best result, huh? That's pretty cool. I expected The Voice, to be honest, but no. Israel, 500... Yeah, that's Toy... Italy, that's City, eh, bu, buon, yeah, that one, <laughs> that's how we spell it, uh, Latvia, uh, what's, this song, what's the song called, uh, with the trumpet hook in the opening and all of the clothing switches, <sighs> song titles, I swear, 2002, Marie N is her name, I believe, I wanna, I wanna, there we go. Lithuania, we are the winners. Amazing. <laughs> Luxembourg, I think this should be Tout le reconnaitra. Wait, what's the song called? Tout la connaitra. Ah, oh, wow. Tout... Oh, God. This is probably my favorite. This could be my favorite winner of all time, and I have no idea how you spell this song. It's by Anne Marie David. Do I get any extra points for that? Can I write that instead? Nope. Tout de la reconnaitra. Maybe it's not even that one. Maybe it's Après toi. What, what other songs have they won with? Uh, no, okay. They also had that one in 83. No. Something with Cadu on the end. Ah, I don't know. Malta. Finished second once. That has to be seventh wonder, I guess. No. Angel? Yep. All right. Moldova has finished third. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, Mama finished third. That's actually one of the craziest things when you just look back at, like, some, some of the results. Hey, Mama finished third. That's incredible. Monaco. They won one time, and the song was another French title. It was, like, Un Bank, Un Abre, Un Rue. Ah, oh, me and French titles. Nope. We'll skip that one for now. Montenegro. Their best result. Is it? Uh, not Inge. Adio. No. Morocco. Uh, yeah, it's the song from 1980, their only entry. I have no idea what it's called. I have it in my head, but I, I don't know how it's called. Arcade for the Netherlands. North Macedonia has to be proud. Norway. Yeah, that's a fairy tale for sure. Poland, second. Oh, Hmm. 94. Portugal. Uh, Amar pelos dois. Some of these uh, foreign languages, I, sometimes I can spell them, but the French ones, those are the tricky ones. Romania, third place, 162 points. Is it playing with fire? It is. Russia, believe. San Marino. <laughs> is it Serhat? Is it actually Serhat? That would be so funny. <laughs> oh, that's actually that's actually kind of funny. I like that. Serbia, uh, Molitva, Serbian Montenegro, Lane Moje, Slovakia. Wow. Like I'm thinking their return in the twenty 
like 2000, when was it, 2009 and 2010, and yeah, they never made the final, I think, so it's probably one of their entries in the 90s. Maybe this one, the Cumnus Mas? If any of you got that out there, I'm impressed. I'm I'm shocked I got it. 96, I think. I think it's 96. That's actually their best result, wow. Slovenia, 7th place, 84 points. That's probably in the 90s sometime. Yeah, it's... Oh, I I know which one it is. It's like super overdramatic. Female singing. Don't know the title of it. Spain, 29 points. Oh, yeah, they've only won like in the 60s. Is it the La La La? <laughs> it is. That's Euphoria. I know that. Switzerland... Ne parte pas Ooh, a French title that I nailed. Turkey everywhere that I can. Everywhere. Everywhere. It's not called that? Every way that I can. Oh my god. Of course. Every way that I can. Ukraine. Let's see if that's Stefania then. No, it's not. It's 1944. Okay. United Kingdom. Winner with 227 points. Love shine a light, I guess. Yep. And Yugoslavia. That's rock me. All right. We have one minute and 46 seconds left. Let's see if we can get any of these that are left. I'm sure like the Monaco one. It's like un banque, un abre, un rue. That's like the only line of the song that I know. And I probably just misspelled it somewhere. I think the song is called that. And the tout, tout les reconnaîtra is really frustrating. I think they spelled reconnaîtra like that, but... It might be a different Luxembourg song, I don't know. What other ones were there? There was the one with the... Uh, with the Greek singer. I've even forgotten her name now. No, I'm not going to get that. Uh, Morocco, I'm not going to get. Slovenia, I think ugh, it's something like Prislutni. Oh my god. I don't, <laughs> I don't know how I got that title, but I got it. Wow. Oh, Andorra, I didn't even notice. That's probably Salve Melmon, right? Wow, okay, okay, okay. France. A winner from France with 136 points. Tom Pilibi? No, they didn't get that many points back then. What other songs have won for France? The Hungarian one I won't get. The Morocco I won't get. Monaco and Luxembourg I guess I won't get. But France. Is it the Loisseur L'Enfant or something like that? Ah. You know what? Never mind. Let's see which ones we missed. There's only five of them. So I got 47 out of 52. Let's see. Louis Etlenthon. I was close. It was the one I was thinking of, 1977. This was also the one I was thinking of, <laughs> the Hungarian one. Just, if you're not Hungarian, you wouldn't get this title. And if you do, then kudos to you. I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. And this, ah, uh, Luxembourg actually was the Cadeau song. Uh, I would never get the title anyway. Un banc, un arbre, un rue. You know what I miss it on? There is an E on the final un. I should study French so I understand grammar rules, because this is a frustrating way to lose it on. It's the song I was thinking of, so let's give me 47 and a half points, please, please. And bit, bit the cup, hob. Yeah, I would never get that. Still, 90%. I think that's that's decent. Let's see uh, compared to everyone else. Like the average score is 71%. So and I got yeah, like the ones I missed are here at the bottom. But I nailed two of the ones, Slovakia and Slovenia. I'm pretty impressed with myself on those two. I'm not going to lie. Can I can I like brag a little bit about that? I will regardless. But yeah, I missed all of the French ones and that's kind of bad, but hey. Anyway, if you like this video, I'm, uh, I will be super happy because it was 
it was a lot of fun for me at least i enjoyed doing this uh and do please tell me how many how many points you got in this how many correct ones did you get so we can compare and do tell me if you want to see more videos like this because as i said this uh, m lingua person here has made quite a lot of of eurovision 18 quizzes so there's there's more to do if if that would be of interest i understand that this is a little bit of a different type of video that maybe some of you won't really enjoy uh and that's completely fine but I just wanted to do something different, and uh, now I've done it. So um, I hope to see you in whatever video comes next. Uh, take care of yourselves until then, and bye-bye. Uh,